growing up with Spider Rift has been challenging, but also um, it's also been good in some areas. When I was 10, I was at school, I was I wasn't getting along at, with people at school, I was getting bullied. But then also finding out that I had spina bifida, scoliosis, hydrocephalus, all at the same time, that was, that was, that was, I think that's been the biggest challenge. So when YFC began with Sim, he was in year 10. And I think for any young man with a disability in a secondary school, it can be really challenging in terms of your confidence, your well-being, how you're doing, and how different a life it is for somebody with a disability like that. First time I met Simeon, you could just tell that he had the weight of the world on him. And he just needed to express those feelings and everything that was going on within him. And you know, I, I do believe that the mentoring created that space where Simeon was able to open up and talk about a lot of these frustrations he was facing. So being able to have someone there who I was able to talk to was really helpful. And because of my hydrocephalus, I find it easier to be able to ha be talking one-to-one -one instead of large groups. So having that one-to-one -one was really helpful support so during the mentoring sessions we talked about life we talked about the challenges of life we talked about his faith we talked about family we talked about school everything that was going on and you know over the time of that academic year that I worked with him I really saw a change just the way he was starting to approach life differently. Because I was being bullied and the, I was man, trying to deal with having this disability, I think my faith kind of, I had a faith, but it was quite a weak faith. And so I think having support there um, really helped. And now I, may, now I, my faith is gone, like is stronger and I'm now a, now I, I'm now going to church and yeah, and being able to enjoy it. So, and I really felt as if God was really starting to impact him as an individual, and he was Simeon was building a relationship with Jesus, which is great to see. I think somebody checking in and just personally one on one gave him a sense of uh, there was a friend and an ally who was standing with him to navigate through those challenges and begin to win more. I think somebody who became a real friend to him could help him discover faith in God and trust in God uh, in a very personal way for Simeon that, again, we look back on was significant in his own journey of finding God for himself. That was a big deal. I've been able to um, go to basketball, start join a basketball team, which I'm absolutely loving. Um, I'm now being able to study IT at college. I'm st still able to do the things that I want to do. However, I just need to find a different way on, on doing those tasks and challenges. So, yeah. And it's great to see him grow. He's grown so much over these past three years that I've known him. And yeah, I, I wish him all the best in the future. And we will, we will still meet up, not every week these days, but once every three months, just to catch up and see what's going on.